Ladies and gentlemen. Let's go to Roswell, Georgia. We still got a guy who read the dossier. Robert, great to have you, sir. Welcome to the EIV Network. Hello. Hello, Rush. It is such an honor to be with you today. Well, I appreciate I provide... that. Thank you very much. Okay. You got it. I want to provide an another example why the fix was in. I read the Russian dossier last night. I saw the references to Paul Manafort and Carter Page, and we know what happened in the FISA courts. But I also saw the reference to the Russians hacking the DNC, and nothing happened there. So if the FBA, FBI was using this dossier to investigate folks, they were investigating the Republicans, but nobody's investigating the DNC hack. Well, there's a reason for that. The, the, de the, the Democrat National Committee, Debbie Blabbermouth Schultz, told the FBI to go pound sand. The FBI wanted to forensically examine their networks after they said the Russians had hacked them. There, the story was that the Russians had hacked the DNC server and had tried to attack the RNC's network but failed. And so the FBI wanted to forensically examine that server to try to find evidence of who hacked, where they were, how it happened. And the Democrat National Committee turned them down, said, no, you can't have these servers. And the FBI said, OK, fine. And they went away. And the DNC hired a private sector company called CrowdStrike, who did the forensic analysis of their server and then came away with that's who told us that the Russians had found their yeah. way into the DNC network and hacked it. I just don't I see it rather capricious from the FBI to investigate Republicans, but they'll take the uh, Debbie Schultz's word for it and not investigate. We're going to get warrants well, it, no, well, no, no, no. the courts over here, <clears throat> no, no. but we're not going to do anything. It, no, it wasn't that they took her word for it. She didn't tell them that nothing happened. She just refused to let them have access. And I'll tell you why. I mean, I, 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 I couldn't make a bet on it, but the, the answer here to me is obviously clear. They were running a rigged game against Bernie Sanders. The Democrat primaries, <laughs> that was rigged. That outcome was preordained. This is, by the way, known, folks. This is not speculation. It is now known the Democrat primaries were rigged for Hillary Clinton. And the evidence would have been found on those servers. That's why she didn't let the FBI in there, Debbie Blabbermouth Schultz. That's why they hired a private sector firm to... I don't even know the private sector firm actually did an analysis. We were told that they did. And, of course, if you hire the private sector firm, then you can control what they tell you after their investigation. So let's say you're Debbie Blabbermouth Schultz, and you're ordering all the men around in your office, tell them to shut up and go out to the outer office. And here comes CrowdStrike. They've got their report. Well, is there any doubt that's how she treats men? Would you want to? I wouldn't. So CrowdStrike comes in and they present their evidence. We've found, Ms. Blabbermouth, that the uh, hack here uh, did happen and that clear evidence here that the primaries were stacked in favor of Mrs. Clinton and Blabbermouth shoots up out of her chair. You will not report that. And as the, as the employee, as the contracted company, they would have to abide by what the DNC said. The DNC could not tell the FBI to suppress it. The DNC could not tell the FBI, you will not make public what you find. But they could tell a private sector firm they hire. I don't think there's any question why they did that. Now, the dossier aspect, the dossier that you read clearly details how they were targeting Trump and Trump associates. Uh, and 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 so forth, but this was the the, the effort to, to get Mrs. Clinton was never serious, and certainly not in the dossier. If if well, that's what I always thought that that if if it's national, if, look, let's set the table here. You have one of the two major, well, both major parties, claiming that hacks of their networks rnc dnc took place and that you're pretty sure that uh that guccifer to russia did it so the rnc lets the fbi take a look and the fbi says you weren't hacked you're clean the dnc 
tells the FBI, no, you cannot examine our servers. And the FBI slinks away and says, okay. That's odd. We're dealing here with the Russians. We're dealing here with national security. And if there's an allegation that the Russians hacked the DNC server, why wasn't the FBI insistent? Why did they not demand Debbie Blabbermouth Schultz stand aside and let them investigate the server? Why did they apparently so easily agree to go away when Debbie Blabbermouth Schultz and the board and Donna Brazil has made all this Don't forget, she had a tell-all book. She has dumped all over Hillary and Blabbermouth Schultz the way they were running the DNC. So this is is not speculation. The FBI simply turns tail and says, okay, fine, you don't want us to look at it, we won't. Why? It's national security. They're spending 18 months trying to track down something the Russians didn't do with Donald Trump. Something the Russians did do to the DNC server They seem to be uninterested. But it all fits with everything else that we know. Hillary was never a target. She wasn't going to be a target. Hillary was, if anything, to be defended, protected, elected. And everybody in the swamp was oriented with that outcome, that objection in mind. 